David L. Ferguson was born in Altoona, Pennsylvania on October 4, 1938. Growing up there, he graduated from Altoona High School in 1956. Following a visit to the Air Force recruiter, where he was told to come back when he was 21, Ferg worked as a draftsman for the city of Altoona, awaiting his coming of age. In 1959, he enlisted into the United States Air Force and entered the Aviation Cadet Program. He received his pilot wings and Air Force commission in January 1961 at Vance Air Force Base, Oklahoma. Following graduation, he served a tour in Misawa, Japan, flying the F-102A, then transitioned to his favorite aircraft, the F-105. He flew the THUD at George and McConnell Air Force bases, prior to the first of two combat tours in Southeast Asia. His first taste of combat was in the F-105D with the 357th Tactical Fighter Squadron at Karat Air Base, Thailand. He flew approximately 40 combat missions from May to September 1965 with numerous additional in-country sorties. Following this first combat tour, he was assigned as an F-105 instructor pilot in Nellis Air Force Base, Nevada. After taking a few local college courses, he was accepted into Operation Bootstrap. Now attending college full-time, he earned his bachelor's degree in mathematics from the University of Nebraska at Omaha in June 1967. A second combat tour soon followed in the 44th Tactical Fighter Squadron from November 1967 to April 1968, also in Karat. Here he completed 102 combat missions in the EF-105F, the original F-105 version of the Wild Weasel. Following his last combat tour, he was shortstopped in Osan Air Base, Korea, flying the F-105, then went back to Nellis Air Force Base, flying the F-111. Through the Air Force Institute of Technology, he earned a master's degree in mathematics from Arizona State University in June 1971. Following this, Dave entered the U.S. Air Force Test Pilot School, where he graduated as a member of Class 71B in June of 1972. He was then assigned to the fighter branch of test operations at Edwards Air Force Base. Here, he flew test missions in the U-2, F-4, and his beloved F-105, falling just short of the 1,000-hour landmark with a total of 990 hours. Continuing into special projects at test ops, he was assigned to the Red Hats, where he conducted tests of several classified prototype aircraft. When the Red Hats became the 6513th Test Squadron, he became its first commanding officer in summer of 1977. There, he served until his retirement from the U.S. Air Force in August 1979. Ferg then joined Lockheed's Advanced Development Projects. He initially served as a test pilot in the then-secret F-117A program and was the second company pilot to fly the nation's first operational low-observable aircraft. He accomplished the first flight of the second prototype YF-117 and also performed the first flight on 19 of the 59 production F-117As. While on the F-117A program, he flew 374 sorties, accomplishing flight tests in loads, performance, flying qualities, high angle of attack, weapons, flutter, avionics, and air refueling envelope expansion. Completing his last F-117 flight on December 8, 1988, he had accumulated 402.4 hours in the stealth. When the Advanced Tactical Fighter Program got underway, Ferg began to transition from the F-117 into YF-22 development.
following years of developmental work and countless hours in the simulator, Dave accomplished the first flight of the YF-22A on September 29, 1990. During the YF-22 Dimbau, he amassed 25 sorties in 35 hours in the prototype with emphasis on structural loads. He played a key role in the aerial demonstration which helped lead to the contract win. Upon the retirement of Mr. Hal Farley, Dave Ferguson became the Director of Flight Operations for the Lockheed Advanced Development Company on July 1, 1991. In this position, he oversaw executive air transportation flight operations until they were moved to Bethesda, Maryland in 1992. In his tenure, he oversaw numerous test programs to include the F-117, U-2, ER-2, Tier 3-, a4AR and big safari C-130s. Additionally, from 1994 to 1997, he served as the director of flight test and operations, overseeing not only flying, but flight test engineering and data analysis. In a flying career spanning 31 years, he accumulated roughly 6,500 hours in over 60 types of aircraft. Some of these aircraft still remain classified. As a result of his combat and flight test accomplishments, he holds the nation's Legion of Merit with one oak leaf cluster, the Distinguished Flying Cross with one oak leaf cluster, and the Air Medal with seven oak leaf clusters. The Society of Experimental Test Pilots has twice selected him to receive its highest honor, the Ivan C. Kinchlow Award, for flight tests of the F-117A in 1983 and the YF-22A in 1991. In September 1998, he was inducted by the city of Lancaster into the Aerospace Walk of Honor. Ferg married the former Janet Freed in June of 1964. They have two daughters, Terry Dowling of Berkeley, California, and Bonnie Ferguson, a professor at Kent University in Canterbury, England. He has one grandson, Kean Dowling, born in August 1992. He is a member of the Red River Valley Fighter Pilots Association, a fellow and past president of the Society of Experimental Test Pilots.
Ladies and gentlemen, I present Mr. David L. Ferguson, an aviator reaching beyond the limits toward new horizons. Thank you.